Hello guys, um, today we're going to talk about the episode Good Night Central City, which aired on May 4th, 1991, and it's about 47 minutes long. It had 7.9 out of 10 on 90 views, about 93-ish user votes. It guest stars uh, Bill Mummy, M-U-M-Y, and he was in Babylon 5 and Lost in Space. I, I just wanted to throw another one in there, a lot of sci-fi stuff. And the episode was directed by uh, Mario Azoparity. Who uh, direct? Who was the director of a RoboCop TV series? Um, so this episode's intriguing. The episode doesn't have a huge villain, but it does. It does kind of have. Um, it does have an, in, an intriguing thing because because a lot of special effects are used, but basically the premise is like um, two bad guys. One who's doing it for science, the other one who just wants money, and they're in fam their family, and it's kind of this. It kind of I don't want to say it's Twilight Zone esque, but if you take out the Flash part, the superhero part, and just focus on like the villain part and focus on that, and maybe throw in some black and white, it could you could definitely see it as kind of a Twilight Zone kind of thing because. Because the descent of the bad guy in this, in terms of like where he is in the beginning story, at the end, it's kind of, it's kind of terrifying. Because he does, he starts doing some stuff that's kind of cold-blooded, and which you wouldn't see. It's pretty, it's pretty intense. Because what, because the people he hurt are not bad people, and it's pretty. Interesting. Now I do like the special effects on this on the on what the big thing which is the sleep a sleep machine and it's a pretty it's a pretty big weapon cuz it affects everyone equally so it's pretty it, it's a very cha it's a very challenging feat for the guys and uh and and it's very and and Barry gets some heat too from another thing that happens and I'm not going to give too much away on the plot just because like I said, I don't like giving away stuff, and and yeah, it does everything right. The special effects, atmosphere, and everything. I think I think what what's shocking about the episode how good this is when they kind of they kind of kind of stop cold on giving like comic book villains and focus on something more created for the show, but it works because because there's there's complexity in the group of villains and it makes the episode give it dimension and everything else is well done too of course like usual um there's that much i can say about it other than it's other than it's um is there really a, any cheese in it um not necessarily um maybe maybe some of the now I think about some of some of the timing of the the sleep machine. Can, I guess you could see as a little funny, but not not really a whole ton of cheese in this. This is kind of more of a. This is definitely more of a. It's a well constructed episode based more on originalness instead of taking from the comics, and and it, and it does it very well. Um. It, I, I definitely say it's a watch just because the villain complexity definitely stands out and and once you get to the climax it's, it it gets pretty it's it's interesting it's interesting that's the best word to describe it it's kind of interesting how they manage to do what they do in this without relying on like comic book villain heavy hitters of the flash so but yeah, that's all I'm gonna say about it. There's not really much else to say. It's like the series is just so awesome. There's not really a whole lot of criticism to get into. It's not like when I did Goosebumps and you had up and down episodes and you had some stuff to pick at. This series, I mean, I'm sure with some people they might find stuff to pick at if they watch it, scrutinize it, and everything. But if you just watch it as is with everything like in knowledge of the the history and the thing behind the show it's pretty awesome there's not really a lot of complaints to it but yeah this episode is solid i i i say it's a watch i don't say skip i mean if i mean i can understand like within at some point if you're going to eliminate some episodes that i don't know if this will make 
a certain top, but it's definitely, if if you have the time, don't skip it. I mean, don't skip any episode in the series as a whole, but this is one that I, I don't, this isn't, a, I don't think you should skip this one. But, um, like anyone should, I don't, I don't think this episode needs a skip at all. But, um, but yeah, guys, that's all I have to say about that. Um, the episode's a good one, check it out, and, uh, yeah. Thanks for watching, guys. Uh, please subscribe and like the videos, and have a good day.